What's new in Adobe Dimension CC 2020? Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Digital Creations and in this video tutorial we will learn about new features and enhancement in the November 2019 release of Dimension CC 2020 version 3. So let's get started. Dimension CC 2020 introduces the new universal selection tool so we can uh, move, rotate and scale objects along the surface very easily so uh, you can uh, enable this uh, universal selection tool by directly uh, select the object 3d model so here you will see this widget is a pair universal selection tool so and you can do select it by simply the uh, left side in the toolbar panel so select tool and the short key is v so I'm going to select this universal selection tool to show you and guys here you will see uh, these handles uh, the circle and uh, the arrow and the square handles so what is the use of this and the uh, these handles are used to and for transformation so uh, these arrow is uh, used to move the object along the surface in 3d axis uh, we can move it in xyz uh, directions and uh, these circle handle uh, you will see this move used to rotate the object uh, in three axis and now guys here you will see this uh, these score handle also used to scale objects in each axis and hold shift key to scale object proportionally so i'm just going to press command to scale this object uh, and with the help of this universal selection tool it is so easy to do uh, move rotate and scale objects without swapping uh, these uh, transformation tools so i'm just uh, i downloaded these 3d models in adobe stock from adobe stock so you you can download uh, from Adobe stock website and directly from here on the asset panels and uh, and it is free I'm going to drag and drop uh, another 3d model this laptop um, let me set this And with the help of uh, this single select tool universal selection tool you can do all the layout interactions very easily so you can move rotate and scale uh, the objects very easily And here you will uh, change uh, right side under the properties panel you can change the position of the pivot point top of the center and center bottom of the center so with the help of this uh, universal selection tool so you can easily create a scene and, uh, and do all the layout interactions easily now guys another new feature is in adobe dimension cc 2020 is the new renderer preview mode is uh, uh, available in at the top of uh, on top of the screen you will see here and uh, in the new blended preview enable high quality rendering effects uh, like reflections and lighting directly in your canvas by blending uh, from real time to ray trace engine so simply i'm just going to click here and you will see here uh, it is super fast and uh, uh, you can uh, see the real time uh, effects in with the help of uh, ray tracing engine uh, ray tracing is simply a rendering technique uh, that aims to simulate the using of the way of light bounce off object and create more realistic shadows reflections and lighting effects so uh, by the help of ray trace engine we can see the photorealistic uh, rendering uh, very easily and quickly directly onto, onto the canvas 
so a render preview shows the quality of your the quality preview of your design mode but uh, we will get the final result high accurate uh, after final rendering so you will get the final result by using this render mode here so but with the help of ray trace engine it is uh, super easy and fast you, you will see the rendering preview uh, directly onto the canvas by blending uh, the preview enable high quality rendering effects with the help of uh, real time and ray trace engines you can uh, preview the settings uh, the you can decrease the resolution to half one fourth uh, depend on your computer speed another top new feature of adobe dimension cc 2020 is uh, the new lighting system so we can create custom lighting by adding multiple sorts of lights so here in the asset panels uh just going to select the lights And here in the asset panels uh, left side you see there uh, the new lighting system and introduces uh, directional light circle light square light sunlight and three point light and in adobe dimension uh, there are three type of lighting system uh, number one is uh, these environmental light uh, which is the panoramic images so in my previous videos you will see that uh, type of rendering images uh, by the help of environmental lights so uh, you check this uh, do those videos and uh, let me uh, show you these uh, new three-point light system so simply uh, just uh, drag and drop these lights so I'm just going to select it and drag and drop to on my canvas or scene and guys in the right side uh, you will see this environmental light these three lights uh, available here so you can change uh, adjust the properties of the light uh, so i'm just going to select this key light and before uh, showing the result you have to enable the render preview mode to show the real-time results by using ray trace engine and here in the properties panel uh, you will change uh, you can adjust the color of the light intensity of the light you can change the rotation of the light and adjust the height of the light and shape of the light downside circle or square now guys these are some new features of adobe dimension cc 2020 and in this way you will create uh, a 3d photorealistic images uh, to create your mockups uh, so i hope you like this video and uh, don't forget to like subscribe my channel digital creations thanks for watching